What is going on everybody? Mr. On YouTube, we're coming at you with a Call of Duty video today. Uh, I'm playing Team Deathmatch on Warhawk and I go 31 to 10. I know it's not the best yeah. gameplay you'll ever see on Team Deathmatch, but I still think that 30 kills plus is an amazing achievement. So, um, yeah, this is my first ever 30 plus on Team Deathmatch. I've got like 29 and 28, so I thought, you know what, I've just got it. I might as well do this for you guys. I know it's not the best, but I might bring out some more gameplays on Call of Duty. So if you do want that, please thumbs up this video, and I may I will make sure I do Call of Duty for you lot. Anyway, I'm using the Maverick. It's an awesome gun in my opinion, but I still haven't sussed it all out, so I don't know what best to chat attachments to use. I'm using armor piercing and silencer. It's uh, them two are really good. At the start, you always go here because someone always runs out around that corner and you always get the first blood. It's it's probably the best place to go right at the start. So, any tips there, I'll give you tips and tricks if you really want this. All you got to do is thumbs up this video. And yeah, I'll make sure I do that with all my other videos. But anyway, coming off um, the gameplay, I've got something important to tell you about what me and my brother like and American people like is American football. Um, it's Super Bowl Sunday. Get in there. This Sunday, Super Bowl is happening. It's um, Seattle Seahawks versus Denver Broncos. Probably going to be one of the best games I'll, I'll, uh, I have ever seen in my life. And uh, I've only seen about 18, 19 games in the past two years because I've only started watching it from two years ago. I used to support New England Patriots, but now I'm a Tennessee Titans fan purely because I know a lot more about the game. And um, I like the badge and the kit, so I thought, you know what, I'll change from... New England Patriots to Tennessee Titans. Uh, yes, I like Tennessee Titans quarterback for Jake Locker. He is absolutely a beast. Uh, if you play Madden 25, you should know he's a very low rated. I think he's about 74, 75 rated on the team. Uh, I think he's uh, not rated enough. I think he should be up in the 90s because he is absolutely amazing. But anyway, all American people should be having a party on Sunday purely because of the Super Bowl. I am going to be doing it back here in England. As you can probably all tell, I'm from England, and um, American football isn't a big sport in England. It's probably in a one in a hundred people will enjoy the game, so they'll know what the game's about, and they'll actually enjoy watching it. So there's a very rare chance that people will like American football. And I want to say to all England pe English people or people abroad, start watching American football because you'll enjoy it. Trust me. I know you might like soccer or football as you will call it, but I'm not a fan of that. I prefer American football. It's bigger hits, more more aggression, and it's just an absolutely amazing sport. It gives you adrenaline rush, trust me. It, it picks you up all the time, and it's absolutely amazing to watch. But if you're not a fan of it, then don't worry, but still please give this a video a thumbs up because I am giving you guys some things about American football. So, American football, what's... What is it like? What's it like to watch? What's it like to do? Um, my brother's recently started playing, so I went to recently go watch a uh, American football kind of training session. And um, you all think, yeah, they just turn up to a game and just hit people. And yeah, but they got to still train. But they, um, the way they train is amazing. It's completely different to all sports. They go into two different teams. They go in the offense squad and then the defense squad. And in defense squad, you get all the cornerbacks, the defense lines, and, and all the um, defense people, I suppose. And then in offense, you get the quarterback, the offense blockers, the wide receivers, the halfbacks, the running backs. So they all go to different things and learn about what they want to do and what they need to improve on. And then they all come together. But <laughs> this Sunday, I believe that Denver Broncos and Seattle Seahawks have uh, already done all training for this. And um, I'm expecting a big game from it, and I think probably all American people are as well. Um, New England Patriots and San Francisco 49ers fans will be a little bit disappointed as they didn't get into the final, but I still think that CLC Hawks and Denver Broncos deserve to be in the final because of the way they played, and um, purely because them two were the best this this season. They're both going like 13 and two or 14 and two or something like that. I can't remember the um, stats for sure, but it's something around them lines. So if you know what they were, can you comment down below, please? Because um, I want to know because purely because of betting reasons. But yeah, because uh, my friends come around, and I'm going to probably place a bet on them and see who wins. And uh, yeah, so <coughs> hopefully if I can win it, then I might win a bit of money. 
and it might go towards a new microphone so yeah if I do if you know what it is please comment down below because it could help my video quality out a lot better for everyone to hear my voice a lot bit clearer and try some and I'll try and make myself a little bit more enthusiastic um, doing videos but back to the Super Bowl it's um a thing that happens every year it's uh, the biggest event in America I would say um, everyone last year there was a lot of supporters um, at Baltimore Ravens Stadium oh uh, no it was actually at New Orleans Stadium sorry and um, I stayed up till 5 o'clock in the morning to watch that uh, the lights went out for three hours and I'm hoping it doesn't go out on Sunday because I really can't be bothered to stay up until like 5 o'clock in the morning because of the power cut again but if that happens then I will uh, but this year is going to be an absolutely amazing game. Denver Broncos. I'm expecting Denver Broncos to win because they've got a better side. But it could all happen on the day. It's like in every sport, something could happen on the day. So Seattle Seahawks might come back and win it. Uh, Denver Broncos might just slip away. But they could just get an easy, quick and easy start. But <clears throat> then again, we've got to see what happens. But Super Bowl Sunday, I'm hoping everyone watches it. Even if you're English, I would recommend you to watch it because you might start liking the game a lot more. I didn't, I didn't like the game until I actually watched it, and um, I like rugby. I used to watch rugby a lot, and then um, I found out American football is pretty much the same as rugby, just a little bit more tougher and um, a little more better, I would say, because I'm not really a fan of rugby anymore. I'm a fan of American football. But yeah, if you um, do want to start watching American football I'll say start on Sunday because it's a Super Bowl and then choose your team from there but I can't really say much anymore about it so um, yeah I hope you do enjoy this video uh, please leave a li uh, like on this video please comment on whatever you want um, I'm going to be starting doing question of the day for you guys so question of the day who do you reckon would win the Super Bowl Denver Broncos or Seattle Seahawks please comment down below and um, yeah I want to know what your guys opinions on um, anything and also, if you want to see more Call of Duty gameplay, I will do it. Just leave this video a thumbs up and I'll start doing it. So, uh, yeah, I do hope you enjoy this video. I'll go 31 to 10 and I'll catch you all in a bit.